All right, y'all. Today I know you guys starting to see the, the white walls. This is actually in the storage closet. I was just painting the ceiling yesterday. So the ceiling is white ceiling. The wall is gonna light because of the plan. So, yeah. But, that's the storage closet. And mm -hmm. you get a better view. Go back into the living area, living room. And this is the wine cellar, wine closet. I painted it too. Um, so I did that yesterday. And I already painted in here first coat. Um, but I have to do it again because I have to fix some part of the ceiling. Um, so I did that yesterday. I still haven't finished up this top yet. All those gonna be wood that's sitting down there. Gonna be finished and stained. Make a little different. This other room I painted yesterday and during the painting I found a lot of little mistakes. You guys can probably see that. Got the waters, the cylinder's white, but I can see it. Um, that need to be fixed. So I was gonna do that today, but I was like, let me just shoot a quick video on some updates. So I finished priming this room. I gotta actually paint the room, but I wanna finish the ceiling before I actually paint the room because I don't want all the dust from the sanding um, getting on there. This is the closet in the room. Um, it's a good size closet, right? And then we're going across the room here on the other side to this other room. Um, pretty design, I did all that, make it nice, and uh, I painted the ceiling in here too, so this is all done, there's nothing in here to be fixed, this one spot, but I'm going to touch it up when I get to it, and, and sand it, and uh, got some more wood that's going to be going on the trim, and that's the closet over there, big closet. You know, uh, I did a good job in here. Can't believe it, but yes, I did all this myself. A lot of work. And then outside, you guys can see the backyard. Still got to do some work out there. Got to put these trim in the in the windows. Okay. And then this is my little DJ booth. Um, because I like to play music, so you know, this is DJ booth. I finished painting the ceiling, but I think I'm going to end up painting a darker color. So, when this back here is like a storage, but it's all the electrical um, for the theater room. And this is for the speakers. They're going to be sitting up against the back wall. And this are the speakers cable coming in here. Like I said, this is going to be my DJ pool. So my little instrument going to be sitting up here. And uh, this area here. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it right now, but you see all the outlets. This is going to be for refrigerators, they're going to be right here. And then those outlets are going to be like for popcorn machines or whatever. It's going to be like a walk-up bar. And then we're going to have some little stuff on the top for drinks and stuff. And then that back wall is going to be some TV. And then on this wall, of course, going to be some whatever. Pictures, arts, whatever, stuff like that. Um, there, there we go. Uh, look, let's go back up upstairs into the house. I gotta paint all that. I didn't do that, I was already done. I just gotta paint. So, I spent a day finishing up this area. All my handiwork. I think it looks pretty good. And this is, is the, what does French say? Resistance? There's a word that comes before resistance, but I can't think of that word right now. But this is the theater room. There's going to be a little step at the bottom there. We should sit over there right now. Uh, there will be a bottom there and it will be all finished. And then it's going to be copper. Um, and then in here will be copper also. I initially put some outlets in here for like to put in um, 
like uh, what's it called? Electric chairs. So they can put electric chairs in here, but I, I probably don't want to need this all out of that. So this is the actual one, and there's another one over there. And then I come in here. This is the two level. And I got second level on the floor. I'm going to do the outlet for the chairs that are going to be in here. So my goal is to have two on this side, two on this side. And then when you come down here, have another two there and two there. Alright, and then in the back, maybe have three chairs. Um, I don't know if it's going to be three or two. It might just be two just for me, or one, I don't know, but, you know, that's the goal, to have one or two chairs back there, you know, or just a separate chair, you know, a seat, bar, or whatever, chill out, alright, and then this is for the projector, that's the outlet, I got two cables coming down for the projector, for backup, and I have two cables over there, I'm going to have a TV in here also, so I got two cables, it's just my cables for the TV. Um, those are for lights. And I got outlets in here for people in here might want to plug up the iPhone or whatever. You know. So I got outlet there. I guess I forgot to put one over there, but there's an outlet in the back. I thought I had another outlet in there, but for some reason I guess I didn't. Um, and those are outlets for the light. Okay, and then I got an outlet down there, it's gonna be for my sub. It's gonna wire for the sub. Another outlet over there for the sub. It is the the whole box that has the uh, electrical area in it. And it's another piece to go with this that's sitting in the wall. Um, so that's, one, that's pretty neat. And I got another hole right there for the speaker. So I'm gonna have sub, sub, speaker, 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 and then there's gonna be another speaker there, and then a speaker there, speaker there, and a speaker there. So this room is gonna be pretty well. I mean. I can barely hear the TV upstairs and I really have to like be quiet to listen. And the door is open so once I close this door, my pocket door, I don't know if I can close it all the way, yes, close the wire. There's still gaps between the door because I haven't been finished yet. I can't hear nothing. That's a solid door, solid, solid door, so it keeps the sound in. It's a little bit of echo because I, it's, there's no copper in here. But once we put the copper in here, that's going to help with the, with the echo. Um, and I got the six reset light in here, which is dimmable. Um, and the sconces. So, uh, I think it'll be, it's going to look pretty good. Um, as far as screen goes, probably going to be like a 90 inch to a 100 inch. I'm going to get the biggest screen I can get in here. And then I'm going to have a TV, like I said, on the wall. So, um, if I'm going to be one of those drop screen that comes down. Um, you know, I didn't really figure that out when I was putting this thing together. So the fact that there's a TV on that wall, there could be a built-in that's going above there that's going to house the projector when it comes down so it might work to where when we built when I built it out it might it might look like it was made that way but it just takes some engineering to get it just right but yeah so you know this is like a my whole basement my whole basement update so it's not just the theater room it's also the basement I know um, I've been doing videos um, here lately um, on this project. I haven't really done a lot of videos when I started the project initially because before I started doing YouTube. 
Um, but I think almost a year later, I've been doing YouTube now almost seven, eight months. Um, so I just started doing videos about the basement, but I know where to bring my camera down here because it's just easy to use my iPhone, don't worry about the dust and whatnot. But, um, you know, if you guys have some suggestions on what I can do to improve my my theater room, you know, I'm looking forward to it. So send me any suggestions you guys have. I very much appreciate it. Thanks for watching Full TV. Subscribe to the channel. Love you guys. I holla. Deuces. Bye.